I'm Marcel Fontenot and this is a look at headlines from the KDC newsroom for this Friday, March 25th. Brandon Francisco, the person of interest in the Ella Goody case, is under arrest. Francisco was arrested by U.S. Marshals in Missouri. He will be extradited back to Rapides Parish, where there's a warrant for his arrest for failing to appear in court. Now, he is believed to be the last person to have contact with Goody when she went missing March 9th. Goody last told her family she was bringing a person to Houston, then returning home. Her SUV was tracked heading to Texas early that morning, and then coming back to Louisiana and back to the Dallas area. The FBI and U.S. Marshals are also investigating her disappearance. Ella Goody is from Scott. An investigation underway after a body was found in Jeff Davis Parish. The call came in as a grass fire on Topsy Bell Road yesterday. When firefighters were there, they found the body. The state fire marshal's office is leading the investigation. Tomorrow is election day here in Louisiana with several races in Acadiana. Polls open at 7 tomorrow morning and close at 8 o'clock tomorrow night. If you're in line at 8, you will still be able to cast your ballot. Remember to bring your photo ID. And you can count on KATC to bring your results all evening long, including on air and KATC.com. And turning now to weather, Rob, kick your feet up this weekend. An absolutely yeah. beautiful one, right? Uh, yeah, that's the type of weather we like. We'll have our feet up, but we'll be checking on the computer throughout the weekend for the next weather maker. That's coming Wednesday. Near term, though, high pressure, large and in charge. We start off in the mid to upper 40s for our Saturday, but we'll top out in the upper 70s for uh, Saturday afternoon. Uh, cool again Saturday night, Sunday morning temperatures in the lower 50s to start the day, and then we warm up nicely into the lower 80s, we think, for Sunday afternoon. So warm weather ahead. In the near term, if you're heading on out this evening, temperatures dropping down through the 50s into the mid 40s by morning, and a beauty out there tomorrow. I don't think they get much better for spring as tomorrow with the cool start and a warmer finish will touch 79 perhaps 80 in a few spots and as we go down the road we're looking at nice weather at least through early next week it gets windy late monday into tuesday ahead of our next weather maker that promises a good chance of storms some possibly severe we'll have be tracking that and have updates on that in the days ahead that's it for news and weather for right now we'll have more in another segment